Good morning and welcome to Nora's Dog Training Company. My name is Rich, we're here with Peppa, and we're going to demonstrate a lot of the obedience commands we've taught and reinforced while she's been with us and the training equipment that we're using. Typically we use a standard six foot web training leash. We try to keep the bulk of that leash folded neatly in our right hand, which leaves our left hand free to make little corrections. And the only corrections we give here at school is a little tug and release. We're also using clicker, which you can see Peppa hears and acknowledges, and basically we're using that for positive reinforcement and sometimes the occasional treat. Now I know with Peppa at home, a lot of, or some of the issues that you're having are indoor matters, so that's why we chose to do the video inside today. Now as you'll notice, she's seated very nicely at my left, which is where all typical obedience training starts and stops. The first command we're going to demonstrate is proper leash walking, and the command is Peppa heel. Ready? And if you'll notice my hand placement on the leash God. is all the way down here. So if you're walking with her in the neighborhood, don't give her too much slack. Keep your hand where it would kind of naturally fall and that's where you're going to want to grab the leash. And then if it's, you know, if you want to give her the chance to go to the bathroom, of course, give her some slack to do her business. But then when she's done, she comes right back to heel position. Ready? Peppa, heel. Good girl. Good girl. Ready? Good job. Incorporated into our healing is an automatic sit. So whenever we stop, we expect her to sit for us. And that's great, like if you're chatting with a neighbor, coming to a crosswalk. So when you stop, we expect her to sit. If she didn't, little tiny correction, fingertips, basically only, no one sit. But she's been doing great so far. Peppa, heel. Good job. Ready? Nice automatic sit. Now the next command we're going to do is one of our two stationary commands. We call it a sit-stay. So obviously she's seated first. We use our left open palm towards her muzzle and the one word firm command to stay. With your stationary commands, lengthen them out over time. So when she gets home today, you know, 15, 30 seconds, but you're gonna, your goal is to get to three minutes. So she's seated very nicely, stay. And in the beginning, we use, a, like I said, our six foot training lead. We go out to the end of the leash, have her hold this, and we get a couple options. I can either call her, and the idea is that she comes back and sits facing me. No. The idea is that she comes back and sits facing me, or I can return back to her. I'm going to call Peppa out of this. Ready? Peppa, come. Good. Sit. Good job. So, clicker's malfunctioning, but she comes back and she sits. Did a really nice job with that, and that's great for... For one of the big things that everybody's looking for is your off-leash recall. Like if she's outside in the fenced-in area, calling her and have her, having her come back. Peppa heel. Good job. Ready? Good. Stay. And what I tell a lot of our clients is buy like a 15-foot a training lead. So you can slowly increase the distance between you and Peppa and challenge her a little bit more. Come. Good. Sit. Good job. Good. Now the next command we're going to demonstrate is going to be the down from heel position. A little bit more challenging for her. She hasn't mastered it. And uh, some days are great. Other days are a little inconsistent. But if she doesn't lay down, like I pulled a bed out for her, we're going to have her go to the bed, we're going to have her sit first, and then we're going to have her lay down. If she doesn't, the only thing that I really need to do is sometimes I'll take my, my hand and slide her front feet out from under her to have her lay down. Like I said, some days she does it every time, other days, eh, typical dachshund, sometimes a little inconsistent. Ready? Peppa, heel. Ready? Good. Ready? Down. No, of course, when the camera's rolling. So if you need to, just slide. 
her little front lights out. And because she's sometimes reluctant, that's where I try to really make it a positive. Praise her, click, treat, lots of affection, belly rubs, of course. She's done a great job here at school. Housebreaking's been excellent. I'm going to bring a packet home, a training packet home for you guys this afternoon. Um, we're going to get ready to get her in the bathtub. And we want to thank you so much for using Nora's dog training. And I'll see you in a couple hours.